Zombie na game mata gagat lo. Yeah. Mm, we can go for because they don't. No problem with milk. Problem is with the pellets. Ooh. We're still inside and <laughs> matamad ng oras na. Uh, medyo maano yung ilaw eh. Kasi dito ang tama ng ano. So, um, there is, um, the comments of the masters from the rabbitry world is in. And, um, most of them agree. Um, thank you sa kay Sir Renz Perado, kay Sir Brian Yap, kay, um, Orange... What's her name? Orange! I just saw you! We're still inside the house. Orange! Mom, wait. I want... Can't Jerwin Tunggala. Ayan. I went back to my Facebook, to my Rabbit's Rabbit's Facebook account to check in and uh, make special mentions uh, for the inputs. Kay Sir Sake. Uh, Bob, ba, thank you sa additional information. Um... Sa lahat po ng mga nagbigay ng inputs, maraming maraming salamat mga master. Sir Brian Yap, Sir Renz Perado, Sir Tunggala, um, kay Sir Sake Bamba, thank you, thank you so much. And what the masters have, have both in common is um, no feeds for two weeks old. Yan. We've never had that though. One, since the, the, do, the kids are with the mama dose, no, so um, the pellets are there since wala pa nga kaming J feeder. We still don't have a um, a nice setup. So we have in the kainan, the water and the the feeds and um kung ano yun na dun sa kulungan, the kids will start to um, explore and therefore eat the eat with the mom. The feeds, the grass, and drink the water. Lub lub sa ano, as you can see. So I did not think of it as um, as an issue. So the constipation and bloat, parang pareho like line breathing and in breathing issue. Um, it's one thing that we want to not have in our rabbit tree. So. Um, in that case, um, <laughs> kasi may mga times talaga na tamad kami manakate. Yung mga feeling me, ganyan. So, what we should do right now is to not give them ad libitum pellets na lang. Minimal, minimal pellets na lang. And, uh, more milk, cause Paris got really scared as she, she was saying kanina na she got really scared kasi nga namatayan kami and that um, that's a good batch eh though they're small though I was thinking na oh nagsasabi akong small sila but I think it's too early to say kasi nasanay kami dun sa chain isa na i-reproduce ni Cal ni Breed at saka ni Ninja Mother na talagang hindi pa wala pa silang one month they were already um, one kilo and at two months nag one and a half na sila ganyan so maganda, mag malalaki that's why I can't stop raving about the F1s and can't wait to have our pure breeds sobrang excited na salamat sa COVID may time pang mag-aral <laughs> ayan so there are several things um, Sir Gilbert's trying to inject synthetic um, rabbitry and my husband um, kept saying about like um, siguro familiar na din kayo sa trend ng um, yung pag inject ng similia similia mga ganong issues and stuff though medyo ano na we'll, we'll focus on raising good rabbits first and then move on to the next or there are several several things talaga na we want to explore especially the ones that would adapt to our kind of lifestyle lalo na ngayon na mai-extend ang covid no not the covid mai-extend ang quarantine si ang period ng quarantine so yun let's go to the rabbit tree uh -huh. Ayan, at yung aking mga wrinkles hindi na mare-repair 
Aha. Medyo late na. Pagalitan kami nito. Um, good morning po sa lahat. And welcome to our channel. I always seem to forget kasi kapag nag-on na ako ng recording, dire-diretso na ako magsalita ng kung ano-ano. But, um, doon po sa mga bago pa lang sa aming channel, welcome to our channel. And, um, I am Lorena Estelia. We are in the farm. We are city folks who have ventured full-time in the farm. Not for business initially, but for um, homesteading. We wanted to raise our own food. We wanted to raise our children with um, responsibilities, having this kind of living. Raising your own food, since lahat naman sila sobrang uh, mahilig sa hayop. And what we do here, um, it's sort of a, a, a lifestyle channel. So, it goes on a day-to-day -day basis kind of thing no so to to get updated and wa on what what's happening what what is she talking about um you may want to go back to the previous vlogs that we've ha we have entered dahil nga um we we want to document everything about what's happening for you guys to see how the kids are growing how we're how what's the result of the things that we're doing here so, yun po ang channel namin. Excuse me, kumakain ako. We have two weeks orphan kids na orphan nga sila. Nawalan sila ng nanay. So, what we did is um, give them Bear Brand and Bear Brand and Jolly Cow. So, in order to see which is better and what's gonna work, we gave Jolly Cow dun sa tatlo at tatlo din dun sa tatlong bear brand naman dun sa isa so may namatay kaming isa kahapon probably because of over of constipation or bloat sobrang laki kasi nansyan niya so that is the reason why I had to ask the masters about this kind of thing and Daddy was feeling really bad because he suggested unlimited, unlimited milk, which may have caused the kids to die, but it's not the milk that killed him. It, it's the pellets overfeeding of pellets. Ayan. Yesterday we had a lot of malunggay malunggay sticks. So, ayan. Pero silang malunggay shoes yesterday. Ito yung kay KFD. Ayan. Ito naman yung kay SB. Mahinhin. Si SB mahinhin. Ganda-ganda yung SB. Ito naman yung kay Cal. So, lahat sila. It's very good for their teeth. And since it's malunggay, it's very healthy. We know that for sure. Milk giver, can you get my coffee? Thank you, though I'm not sure if I'll be able to finish that. That's my second cup. Sam is already here. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Hi, dito na nga. Ayoko pang harapin. Eh. Natatakot ako. Ayan. Ang lalaki nan chan. Sam, excuse. So, are you okay? This is the lion head that we're... He does. Made hiwalay kasi nga. No, good morning. Where's your son? Son ba? Ayan. Siya ngayon ang aking featured rabbit dahil ito ang anak ni J Jojo eh. Ayan. So, siya ang uh, nasa profile picture ko. Siyempre, playing favorite. Salam nyo na. Ayan. So, day 8. This is Bear Brand. So, we'll take out the, ano, ayun. Guilty as charged. We'll take that ah. out. <laughs> Sabi niya, wait. Wait. Okay. 
But one one thing too is that the reason why we're giving milk, si, kahit na kumakain na sila, is we wanted them to complete the one month um, milk so, milk intake. No, so we weaned before. Etong mga batch. Ano kang mite? Ang cute mo, spoiled na spoiled. Um, ano ba yun? What we wanted to do is to have them complete the one month milk intake. Since that's the thing na ginawa namin with all the kids that we've reproduced right now. In this season, lahat sila at one month, we need namin from the mom, except itong malaking malaking rabbit, yung si Jojo Jr. Siyempre may favorite. So, um, one month and then hiniwalay na namin si Do and after two weeks of resting and ano, minate na namin yung mga nanay. So, dad wants to go on intensive um, breeding pero medyo hindi ako sumunod sa batas at naawa naman ako sa mga Do ko. So, so they've just been mated after two weeks of rest and then yun. How much did he have? So he is he still drinking? Yeah. You have to pull out the feeds, no? Okay. I'll just give um maramais. Four cc na yon. Yep. All right, four cc and then make tanggal na dayan. All right. Sumunod tayo sa mga master. Okay. Ayano, oh. dikinuha niyo kinain niyo din yung mga ano grass. Oh, di ba? Ang lalaki nyo na, shocks. Ah, yung pala yung isang gray. This is the one that you have. Okay. Mga nakati ako. Buti na lang merong hindi mainit masyado doon. Susumbong ako sa inyo ng konti. At yung aking kapitbahay. Meron kasing, um, dito sa kabila, mga kalamansi ang kanilang tanim. Oops. And, naglagay sila ng insecticide from afternoon yesterday. Sobrang sakit sa lalamunan. Kasi, yun nga, syempre, insecticide yun. And even itong pala yun sa aking katabi, last week naman naglagay sila. So, we were like thinking, susumbong ako kay daddy namin na, will this not harm our our rabbits? Kasi nga, lagi sila nag insecticide O, oh, tapos ito pang sa lupa ni Payumo. Shoutout sa aking napakabait na barangay captain dito sa Dalaw, dinalupihan sir, si ka Roy B. Carme. Sobrang accommodating sa mga kakulitan at saka sa mga issues ko. <laughs> Hello po. And yun, I really wish that um, the Philippines, hey! Philippine farming would trans... Tran... Ano to? Uh transcend from from yeah. from synthetic synthetic farming to organic farming because kami kahit na maliit we've try we've we were able to raise good quality yeah. of produce sa vegetables though not sa rice um using uh, manure and ang ganda pa kasi hindi ka na may fertilizer ka na meron ka pang insecticide right actually Noon, ang ginamit ko lang duck, duck and chicken poop. And vermiculture, vermicast. So, after noon, hindi naman ako nag-insecticide and still, yung mga talong noon, talagang wala silang butas. And magaganda naman yung produce ng upo, ganyan. Okay naman, so... I just wish that they would turn into organic farming because that's like... Very natural and mat mas matatamis yung produce, promise talaga. You can really attest to that. And wala ngang, hindi ka na kailangan mag-insecticide. Yun nga lang, talagang syempre, yung mga synthetic na fertilizer at saka insecticide will just flip it open, mix with water and that's it. Unlike ito, kailangan mo pa magwalis, collect yung mga poop and stuff. But, you know, kesa naman magkabaon-baon sa utang dahil kakabili ng mga insecticide and tapos masasalanta pa, right? Mm, ganong issue sa farming. So, ando dun, sa, dun, dun, dun ako sa level na ganun na gusto ko, ang goal ko sa Pilipinas, maging ganun, maging natural growers of everything. Ganyan. Diba? Ang taas ng pangarap. Tama the chicken coop. 
I'm discovered itong mga nag-yellow, yung mga nalalanta-lanta, they like it. You know, enjoy na enjoy siya dun sa parang what's this? Yung ano na, yung ganun na na leaf, yung matanda na. Gusto niya. Gusto nila actually, hindi lang siya. This is a doe kasi eh. So, I'm trying to make them pabilog. This is a doe together with her. Siyempre, yung mga doe muna. No? Lumaki ka, gumanda ka. Huh? Ito, nagbigay sa akin ng stripes. <laughs> You're so cute. Ang cute mo. How are you na ba? Huh? How are you? This is black, my favorite. May natira, hindi ko binigay sa inyo. Wait. Ayan, gusto nila. Um, the issue with the, the grass is that, um, ang fresh has more water which might cause bloat to them but rarely and this one the dried matter has um nutrient still no na okay sa kanila so ang ayoko lang sa ganito lalo na pag nagkurumpol is that um ang daling nila nga lamukin so, lamok is also not good for them. Not good for me and not good for them. So, kakatuwa naman. Buti na lang pala, I flipped it. Also, another staple in our rabbit tree whenever we have ang um, saging. Because my children loves bananas. Also me. Yan. Okay din si rabbits. O, ba? She has small berry. That one has banana skin and the, the boys have um uh grass and this is actually paragis that's plenty in our area mutan ko na tumubo na sila mag isa na buhay na nang mag isa doon it's nice kalimutan ko na yun Alright, but this one died, the one in the soil died, but the one in the water flourished. Kaya madre de agua ang ano nito eh. And surprisingly, um, I think it was in Perad Perado, uh, Persado Farm, um, they eat madre de agua. They call it the mother of all water. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, really? Ay na naman yung egg. Sana hindi ma-discover niyo itong mga aso ko at nakastray sila. Gawa nga ng um wala. Gusto ko lang sila nakastray niyo. Ang dami. Kakatuwa yung mulberry. Daddy already has the cuttings. So, kailangan na lang makauwi siya. Bakit ka naman nabali? market day today and I was able to buy grass cutter yan so masisintensyahan ang mga paragis, mga palipaligid wow, naglabas si Paris ng rabbit yung girl yun siya oh, nice 